Here we have our phosphoric acid, which we're going to titrate with our 0 0.05 normal sodium hydroxide. We need 10 milliliters, so we're gonna use this graduated cylinder right here. Now a note about these graduated cylinders is that they come out, so you, if you don't put it in tight, then it can be wobbly, it can be off center. So make sure you get it essentially nice and tight. And when you're looking at it head on, it should be nice and even. So for the phosphoric acid, you want 10 milliliters. And so to get exactly 10 milliliters, Meniscus here. So, can you see the meniscus? Now, if you overshot it, what you would do is you would take a squeezy bulb pipette and you would gently take out, squeeze it, take out a little bit, right? If you needed to. And then you could always look to see about adding it. So you could do it dropwise. But otherwise, if you need to pull some out, go ahead and let me know, and we'll get you a waste beaker for it. Let's see how good you can get pouring it in to begin with. Put this to the side. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and put in there. And then, essentially, now you need about 50 milliliters. Now what we see is that there's liquid here on there and all inside. So one thing you want to do is take your 18 mega ohm water and gently squirt it. Well, it's seven. You can also use this, which is your, your milliq water as well. And if you feel more comfortable, you can do this. And that is, oh, who knows what that is? Let's estimate that maybe, oh, maybe 12 milliliters, but that doesn't matter. 22, get it all in there. What you're doing is you're rinsing the whole thing out. Maybe three. Forty-four. And if you just want to make sure a little bit more, you can rinse like this. And so the goal is to get every bit of that out. So this should be just water. I rinsed this at least three times to get all of the contents in there. So the next thing to do is to get this very slowly. Nice and slow. Now, now look what we've got here. So hopefully that's just, just water, right? Um, we don't want that to be phosphoric acid. And so then what you're going to do is get it stirring. And you're going to look at the side. 